Have you ever wondered why the Third Temple, a building that doesn't even exist, holds such significance in religious circles? Well, let's unwrap this enigmatic package together. The Third Temple, in theory, is a reconstruction of the Temple in Jerusalem which would follow Solomon's Temple and the Second Temple. Its mere idea carries a heavy weight in Judaism especially among Orthodox Jews who see it as the zenith of their places of worship. But it's not just Jews who are intrigued. This hypothetical structure has found a place in some Christian eschatological interpretations as well. The desire for the Third Temple isn't just a passing fancy it's deeply rooted in Jewish prophetic beliefs. Yet, its construction has been a bone of contention, particularly due to the Dome of the Rock on the Temple Mount. Despite the controversies the allure of the Third Temple remains strong. Let's delve into the fascinating history and significance of the Third Temple. To truly appreciate the significance of the Third Temple, we need to journey back in time. The tale of the Third Temple begins with its predecessors, the First and Second Temples. The First Temple, also known as Solomon's Temple, was a magnificent structure and a centerpiece of Jewish faith and life. However the Babylonians destroyed this architectural marvel in the 6th century BCE, leaving a void in the Jewish community. The second temple rose from the ashes of the first, constructed by those returning from Babylonian exile. This temple stood as a symbol of Jewish resilience and hope for centuries, but alas, it met a fate similar to its predecessor. In the 1st century CE, the Romans laid waste to the second temple once again leaving the Jewish people without their beloved house of worship. Since then, a longing for a third temple has been etched in the hearts of many Jews. This longing is not merely for a physical structure but rather a symbol of spiritual renewal and the fulfillment of prophecy. The third temple signifies a time of peace and divine presence, a time when the Jewish Messiah is anticipated to arrive. But the path to this prophetic fulfillment has been anything but smooth. Let's take a detour to the 4th century CE, when Roman Emperor Julian known as Julian the Apostate, attempted to rebuild the temple. Julian's endeavor was not out of reverence for the Jewish faith, instead, it was a political move aimed at diminishing the growing influence of Christianity. Julian's plans however were thwarted by a series of unfortunate events. Some accounts speak of an earthquake that disrupted construction, while others tell of mysterious fires breaking out at the construction site. Whether it was divine intervention or mere coincidence, Julian's efforts to rebuild the temple were unsuccessful. The turbulent history sets the stage for the prophesied Third Temple. So, we've understood the history, but what makes the Third Temple such a pivotal religious symbol? To grasp the religious significance of the Third Temple, we need to delve into the heart of Judaism, particularly Orthodox Judaism. You see the Third Temple isn't just a place of worship, it's the ultimate sanctuary, the most sacred spot for Jews worldwide. It's seen as the spiritual epicenter, a place where heaven and earth meet. That's pretty profound, right? But the significance of the Third Temple isn't confined to Judaism alone, it spills over into Christian eschatology as well. In the realm of Christian prophecy, the Third Temple holds a crucial role. Some interpretations suggest that its construction would mark the end times, a period of tribulation culminating in the second coming of Christ. Talk about a plot twist. The concept of the Third Temple is, in essence, a symbol of hope and fulfillment. It's the embodiment of prophecies and the longing for spiritual completion. It's seen as the key to unlocking a new era of peace and divine presence. The desire for its construction is a testament to the enduring faith and resilience of the Jewish people. In Orthodox Judaism, the rebuilding of the Third Temple is typically associated with the arrival of the Jewish Messiah. This belief adds another layer of profound significance to the Third Temple. It's not just about a physical structure but also a sign of divine intervention and the advent of a new spiritual era. But it's not all smooth sailing. The desire for the Third Temple also stirs controversy given its location on the Temple Mount, a site revered by Muslims as well. This delicate balance between religious longing and political realities adds a touch of intrigue to the narrative of the Third Temple. The Third Temple therefore represents not just a building but a symbol of religious prophecy and longing. As with any significant religious symbol the Third Temple is not without its controversies. Picture this, a sacred space, revered by many, yet a source of contention. The Third Temple is just that, a hypothetical place of worship, with a potential location that is already home to another religious monument, the Dome of the Rock. This holy Islamic site stands on the Temple Mount, the very ground where the Third Temple is prophesied to be built. 
This overlap of sacred geography has sparked one of the major controversies surrounding the Third Temple. The Dome of the Rock, with its golden dome gleaming under the Jerusalem sun, is not just a symbol of Islamic faith, but also a historical monument that has stood for over a millennium. Its presence on the Temple Mount presents a significant obstacle to the construction of the Third Temple. This dilemma is not just a matter of real estate, it's a clash of faiths, histories, and identities. The debate extends beyond just these two religions. Within the Jewish community itself, there is a divergence of opinions. Mainstream Orthodox Judaism traditionally associates the rebuilding of the Temple with the arrival of the Jewish Messiah. This belief creates a waiting game, a patience for divine intervention. However, a minority within Orthodox Judaism advocates for the construction of the Third Temple in the present times without waiting for the Messiah. They argue that the Temple's construction could hasten the Messiah's arrival, flipping the script on the age-old belief. And let's not forget the Christians. What does the future hold for the Third Temple? That's a question that stirs the minds of many, especially those rooted in the Orthodox Jewish tradition. Imagine, if you will, a world where the Third Temple stands tall and proud in Jerusalem, its glory surpassing that of Solomon's Temple and the Second Temple. This vision is not just a dream but a fundamental belief in mainstream Orthodox Judaism. The anticipation of the Third Temple's construction is strongly tied to the arrival of the Jewish Messiah. It's a profound belief that when the Messiah comes, he will guide the people in rebuilding the Temple, restoring it to its former grandeur. Now it's important to note that not all Orthodox Jews share this exact belief. There are some, albeit a minority, who advocate for the construction of the Third Temple in the here and now. These groups argue that waiting for the Messiah shouldn't be a prerequisite for rebuilding the Temple. Their advocacy is rooted in the belief that the act of rebuilding could itself usher in the arrival of the Messiah. Quite a twist, isn't it? So, we find ourselves in a world where the future of the Third Temple is a tale of two narratives. One awaits the Messiah to kickstart the construction, while the other believes that the construction could attract the Messiah. The future of the Third Temple is truly a fascinating subject, tangled in a web of faith, hope, and anticipation. It's a narrative that holds significant religious, historical, and cultural importance. But as is often the case with matters of faith, certainty is elusive. Whether or not the Third Temple will ever become a reality remains an open question, making it an endlessly intriguing topic of discussion. So, we've taken quite a journey today, haven't we? We've delved into the intriguing mystery of the Third Temple, tracing its roots back to Solomon's Temple and the Second Temple. We've explored its religious significance, particularly in Orthodox Judaism, as a sacred place of worship, and the prophetic desire for its rebuilding. We've also navigated the choppy waters of controversy surrounding the Third Temple, particularly due to the presence of the Dome of the Rock on the Temple Mount. We've discovered the unsuccessful historical attempts to rebuild the Temple, thwarted by natural disasters, sabotage, or perhaps divine intervention. Peering into the future, we've considered the mainstream Orthodox Jewish belief that the Temple's rebuilding is associated with the arrival of the Jewish Messiah as well as the advocacy of some minority Orthodox Jewish groups for its construction in present times. No matter your personal beliefs, the story of the Third Temple serves as a powerful testament to the enduring influence of religious symbols in our world.